Hey everyone, welcome to FS Hackers. My name is Afshan and in this video we are going to store and retrieve a file with Amazon S3. So this is going to be a how to guide. In this video we will store files in the cloud uh, using the Amazon simple storage solution that is S3 and uh, Amazon S3 is a service that enables you to store your data as an object at massive scale. In this guide you will create an Amazon S3 bucket and this this will be the container for our data stored in S3 and will upload a file and will retrieve the file and will delete the file as well and here is the implementation steps the first one is enter the Amazon S3 console create S3 bucket upload a file retrieve the object so this is the guide and after that we'll delete the object so I have already logged in to my AWS account as you guys can see here and you just have to search S3 in the search bar and you will see this service S3 is here click on that store and retrieve any amount of data from anywhere so let's create the bucket you just have to click on this create bucket button and you have to provide the bucket name so we'll write first bucket and make sure that the bucket name is globally accepted you have to write the globally unique name and must not contain the spaces or uppercase letter so we are not using any uppercase letter and spaces here first bucket 88 and the aws region is asia mumbai i am okay with that if you want to change the region you can change it we have different region option available here okay object ownership acls are disabled and it is recommended block public access setting for this bucket we are blocking all access here just leave it as it is because we are not uh, going to give the public access in this video bucket versioning we'll see that in our next video now it is disabled default encryption is also disabled now let's create the bucket okay the first bucket 88 is globally accepted just click on it and uh, here we have the option objects so objects are the fundamental entities stored in the amazon s3 you just have to click on this upload button and click on add files in downloads i have this aws thumbnail so i'm going to open it okay let's upload this file okay now it is succeeded close it click on it aws thumbnail dot PN, png file and open it okay this is the thumbnail this is the thumbnail so we we have stored the file right at this steps we have completed uh, these steps upload a file we have completed these steps add a file now we have to retrieve the object so let's go to the object here click on a object that you want to retrieve and here we have this download option just make sure that you are clicking on this download option okay this particular file is downloaded that's cool now let's delete the bucket okay click on this bucket option check this bucket first bucket 88 and delete this bucket is not empty bucket must be empty before they can be deleted so first we have to delete the object of the bucket go to the bucket and here is here we have our object that is aws thumbnail delete okay we have to write permanently delete copy it delete delete objects you can select all if you have too many objects in a bucket let's close it 
now let's go back to buckets select the bucket and delete here we have to write the name of the bucket our bucket name is first bucket 88 delete bucket okay so we have successfully deleted the bucket and we have completed this tutorial that is store and retrieve a file with amazon s3 so that's it for this video guys i hope you like it if you like my content then please share this video with your friends and your colleagues who are learning about aws and preparing for aws solution architect exam we'll see you guys in my next video till then take care and keep learning Bye bye